You know, it's quite something how we've come to enjoy so many conveniences in our modern lives. Think about it. With a single click, we can chat with someone on the other side of the world, binge watch our favorite show, or even order a delicious meal to be delivered right to our door. It's kind of magical, isn't it? But have you ever paused and wondered, what if all these comforts just disappeared overnight? Take a moment to visualize waking up and finding your local supermarket stripped bare. Those favorite restaurants? Shut down. All the services and little luxuries we've gotten so used to. Suddenly out of reach. Okay, I'm not trying to be a buzzkill or scare you. It's more about taking a step back and realizing how much we rely on these systems and what it would mean if they were to break down. Interestingly, 2023 has thrown some curveballs that make these musings feel a bit less hypothetical. The whispers of potential shortages have grown louder, and it's like they're knocking at our doors. But hey, there's no need to get all panicky about it. Instead, let's look at it as an opportunity to gear up and get ready. You know that old saying, right? Better to have it and not need it, than to need it and not have it. With that thought in mind, there are some essential items we really should consider having around for, you know, just in case. Number 12. Vinegar. Yep, good old vinegar. Most of us see it as just something we splash on our salads or chips. But did you know that its main component, acetic acid, turns it into a superstar in survival situations? It's amazing for preserving food. I'm talking about pickling vegetables to extend their shelf life when you can't just pop to the store and get fresh ones. But wait, there's more. This humble liquid can also be your go-to for keeping things clean and sanitized. Whether you're cleaning kitchen tools, or just want something to help with general hygiene when regular cleaners are in short supply. Vinegar's got your back. It's like the Swiss army knife of the prepping world. So next time you see a bottle, maybe give a nod of appreciation and consider keeping some extra on hand. Number 11, baking soda you say. Oh, absolutely. I know most folks probably just think of it as that powdery stuff we mix into cookie dough. But in the realm of prepping, this stuff is like gold. Ever had your fridge start smelling a bit off? A little open box of baking soda in there will help keep things smelling fresh. Imagine that quality, but in an environment where you can't exactly pop open the windows to air things out. Pretty handy, right? And let's not forget the bonus points for being an excellent cleaner and a quick remedy for heartburn. In times when every little comfort counts, that's no small thing. Number 10. Powdered milk. I know it might not sound as glamorous as fresh milk, but hear me out. This stuff can be a game changer. When you're down to limited food resources, powdered milk can be the unsung hero that keeps your nutrition in check. Need a quick drink? Stir it in some water. Need a creamy touch in your soups or desserts? It's there for you. Heck, you can even snack on it dry if you're feeling adventurous. It's versatile, nutritious, and doesn't spoil easily. Win, win, win. Number nine, and speaking of nutritional powerhouses, have you ever considered dried seaweed? I know, I know, it might not be on everyone's radar, but think about it. A food that's compact, lightweight, and chock full of nutrients. That's a survivalist's dream. In fact, it's not just about survival, it's about thriving. You can crumble it into soups for that umami boost, enjoy it straight from the pack as a crispy treat, or even wrap it around other foods for an added layer of flavor. Plus, its long shelf life means it's just waiting patiently in your stash, ready to lend a hand, or frond when the chips are down. Number eight, canned meats. Let's chat about them for a moment. I mean, sure, it might not be what you'd choose for a gourmet dinner, but when you're looking down the road at the long haul, these protein packed cans are like little treasures. You know that feeling when you open a can of tuna and suddenly you have the makings of a hearty sandwich or salad? Now amplify that relief tenfold when you're relying on stored foods. Plus, the variety, chicken today, corned beef tomorrow. It not only keeps your belly full, but your taste buds guessing. Number seven, my personal saviors, tea and coffee. Forget the apocalypse. Even on a regular Monday morning, I'm so grateful for that cup of Java. But in a tight situation, it's not just about the joy of sipping your favorite brew. It's about feeling a semblance of normality, a reminder of gentler times. And hey, that caffeine kick isn't just good for waking you up. It might be essential for keeping you alert in challenging circumstances. Not to mention, in a world where trade becomes the norm, your stash of coffee beans or tea leaves could turn out to be as valuable as gold. Number six, basic repair tools. You've probably experienced it before. 
the frustration of a broken door hinge or a leaky roof. It always seems to happen at the most inconvenient times, doesn't it? Well, that's where basic repair tools come to the rescue. Picture this. You're in your cozy home, and a storm starts raging outside. The rain is pouring in through that pesky leak in the roof, and you're worried about the damage it might cause. But then, you remember that you have the right tools on hand, a hammer, some nails, and maybe even a roll of duct tape. Suddenly, you're not at the mercy of the elements. You're the master of your domain. It's a peculiar kind of triumph when you can fix things yourself. That hammer and those nails aren't just pieces of metal and wood. They're your lifeline to keeping your environment safe and livable. The security of knowing that come rain or high water, you have the means to patch things up is priceless. In the world of prepping, self-reliance is a cornerstone. You're not dependent on someone else to swoop in and rescue you from every little household mishap. Instead, you're empowered to tackle these issues head on, and that sense of control over your surroundings is incredibly reassuring. Number 5. Maps and Compasses. Anyone? I get it. In our modern age of smartphones and GPS, the idea of fumbling with paper maps and squinting at a compass needle may seem a bit old-fashioned, but let's think about it for a moment. Gadgets can die, signals can be lost, and when that happens, those so-called old-fashioned tools suddenly become your lifelines in the wilderness. Imagine this scenario. You're out in the great outdoors, exploring a remote area, and your smartphone battery just hit zero. No more Google Maps, no more GPS. Panic might start to set in, but wait, you remember you packed a topographic map and a trusty compass. With these tools and your knowledge of the terrain, you can still find your way. You can locate a nearby freshwater source, navigate to a safer area, or even get back to civilization if needed. In these situations, those seemingly outdated tools become your eyes, your guiding lights. They don't rely on batteries or satellites. They rely on your skills and your understanding of the land. So while technology is fantastic, never underestimate the value of having these traditional tools as backups when you venture into the wild. They can make all the difference between being lost and finding your way home safely. Number 4. Let's dive into the importance of glasses and contact lenses. Now, if you're a member of the Can't See Without M Club, you understand just how vital these optical aids are. It's not merely a matter of convenience. It's a matter of survival. Imagine being in a situation where you need to spot potential threats or sources of food and water from a distance. Without your glasses or contacts, you might as well be wandering blindfolded through the wilderness. Picture this. You're in the midst of a crisis, and you accidentally break your only pair of glasses. It's a nightmare scenario. Suddenly, you're at a significant disadvantage when it comes to assessing your surroundings, reading crucial information, or identifying whether that distant figure is friend or foe. That's why having backups is an absolute must. It's not just about having a spare set, it's about ensuring your ability to perceive and make critical decisions remains intact, even in the most challenging situations. Number 3. Garden Seeds When I think of seeds, I can't help but see them as tiny parcels of hope. At first glance, they may seem insignificant, just small specks in your hand. But here's the magic. With time, care, and the right conditions, they transform into life-sustaining, nourishing food. The idea of having a renewable source of sustenance right in your own backyard, well, that's more comforting than any well-stocked pantry. Picture this scenario. In the midst of a prolonged crisis, when supplies are running low, those humble garden seeds become your lifeline. They offer the promise of a brighter future and a reliable source of fresh produce. With some knowledge of gardening, you can turn that small packet of seeds into a thriving garden that provides you with a variety of fruits, vegetables, and herbs. It's not just about surviving day to day. It's about thriving and maintaining a sense of self-sufficiency in the long run. So while garden seeds might not seem like much when you first hold them in your hand, don't underestimate their potential to sustain you and your loved ones when times get tough. They represent resilience, growth, and the promise of a better tomorrow. Number 2. Fire Extinguisher Fire is a curious thing. It can cook your food and keep you warm. But if things go south, it can turn into a fierce enemy, especially when we're in survival mode and potentially using open flames more often. The risks can increase. That's where a trusty fire extinguisher swoops in, turning a potential catastrophe into a minor hiccup. Trust me on this one. It's one of those items you'll be immensely grateful to have within arm's reach if the need arises. Number 1. Insect Repellent I must admit, out of all the things we've discussed, 
This one often flies under the radar. We tend to underestimate the power of those tiny critters, but the reality is, they can pack a punch, especially post-disaster, when the conditions might be ripe for them to thrive. If you've ever spent a night constantly swatting at mosquitoes, you know how much of a relief it can be to have a shield against them. But it's not just about avoiding those itchy bites. It's about safeguarding our health. Diseases like malaria or dang are no joke, and the best defense against them is a solid offense with a reliable repellent. All right, taking a step back, I get it. Looking at this extensive list can feel overwhelming. Do I really need all of this? You might wonder, but here's a way to approach it that won't leave you feeling daunted. Think of it as a journey, not a sprint. Begin with a few essentials, and as the weeks roll by, keep adding. Before you know it, you'll have a well-stocked cache that'll have you feeling confident and ready for whatever lies ahead. The thing is, preparedness isn't just for those folks with bunkers and 10 years worth of canned beans. In a world where things seem to change in the blink of an eye, it's for all of us who value the well-being of ourselves and our families. Being ready isn't about expecting the worst, but about ensuring the best possible outcome, no matter the situation. So, channeling that wise old saying we've been drumming on, better to have it and not need it. Because, at the end of the day, the goal isn't just to make it through, it's to thrive. So, arm yourself with knowledge, gather your essentials, and stride forward with confidence. Happy prepping!